Hey everyone, and welcome back to another Fishful Thinking. Snowy Paraxis is a new legendary fish added in 6.55, whose design is a little bit different than what we usually see. It has a full weather window of 23 minutes, but it only has a 35 second intuition. This leads to a unique approach to this fish that we usually really only see uh, with the fabled legends in ocean fishing. So I'm going to walk through kind of one of these windows and talk about what I did and kind of give you everything that you need to know to be able to catch it yourself. Okay, so to start, uh, before the window, like well before the window, I got 10 English art stacks, I caught two Cerule cores, and the second core I identical casted, and I just precasted Chum because I had the GP to be able to do that. And if I speed through this really quick, I will cast out, I will catch the third Cerule core and get the first intuition of the window. Okay, so I'm going to walk through this first intuition because it's basically the same for every one that you get. So I get the intuition, I immediately use Chum, and I cast back out. I could have used Surface Slap there, um, it's okay in the opening one, but uh, I'm going to get a bite. It is not Snowy Paraxis. I let it go. I chum again. I cast back out. And I repeat that. So I do that a second time. This next bite is not going to be Snowy. And I will let it go. And for this third one, I'm not going to chum. I'm going to cast out. And basically what's going to happen is I will know if I have Snowy. I don't because the text appeared, I didn't hear a chime, and I'm going to reel in uh, the next bite if it was a strong bite, it wasn't, so I let it go, I cast back out, and now I begin to rebuild the intuition. And I'm going to kind of speed through the back part here for a little bit, just because it's going to be kind of repetitive, but basically the way that you rebuild intuition is you reel in any of the strong bites. Those are the two bites, just like now. And if it's Cerule Core, you use Identical Cast, and then you double hook the next, uh, the next bite that you get. I pause for a second because I realize I have GP, so I use Surface Slap. When I Surface Slap Ice Pike, I have an opportunity to basically get a free uh, blind triple hook if the strong bite is after 20 seconds. I don't think I actually ever get that at this point, so I will now actually speed through everything. With that, if you ever go over 20 seconds, you can go for a blind triple hook, which saves you about 50 GP in the grand scheme of things. I don't think it's worth waiting because you can get a bunch of Cerule Core still biting before 20 seconds, so you can use that yourself. This method roughly nets me anywhere between six to eight intuitions per window. I haven't heard anybody getting more than that. I think there might have been one nine, but that like, you're really reliant on the number of cores that you get. So here I'm getting uh, my next intuition or third intuition, I've lost count. Uh, but basically, it's the same steps as before. I use Chum, I wait for the bite, and if it's not snowy, I just let it go by not reeling in, and it isn't, so I just let it go. I use Chum again, I cast back out, and in this particular case, I'm pretty confident that I'm not going to be able to get a third cast in. So what I will do is, if it's a strong bite, which it is, I will start to reel it in. By doing this, I'm able to kind of get like a free cast in and continue to start just continually casting and potentially sometimes even chaining intuitions together. Rarely that happens where you get a Cerule core right at the end, but uh, it feels great when you do. The reason this works is uh, fish that you caught while not under the effect of the buff will count towards the next intuition. So if the buff falls off, I'm just going to keep cast it out. And if it's a strong bite, I'll reel it in. 
and that'll count as a uh, intuition progress if I get the cerule core, uh, because that particular, like that particular snapshot, happens when you actually like catch the fish. And really, that's about it. Um, it this fish is all about GP management over and over and over and over and over again. Um, you see here, I just picked up another intuition. I use identical cast. I'll use the Thalix favor uh, ahead of the window uh, or ahead of getting the intuition because I don't want to waste any time using a cordial or using Thalix favor during that window, during that intuition, because it is so short. So. I make sure I have enough GP uh, for the actual intuition, which would be 600, 400 for the double hook, and then 200 for two chums. I chum, I lather, rinse, repeat. And that's basically how all of your intuition windows are gonna be going. You get intuition, you chum, you cast, you let it go if it's not snowy, you chum again, you cast, you let it go. If it's not snowy, you cast. So basically every every intuition will cost you uh, 350 GP plus 400 GP. So that's identical cast plus double hook plus 200 for two chums. So that's a grand total of 950 GP for a quote unquote perfect intuition window. Um, when you're considering uh, GP management, I try not to go too far away from 950, but I also keep in mind that I have access to cordials, which is going to be 400 uh, additional, and uh, Thalix Favor, which is going to be another 150 per three stacks. So basically, uh, keep that in mind. It's going to be doing a lot of math during the window to make sure that you have enough to be able to actually like identical cast and double hook. But beyond that, that's kind of the whole loop for snowy. You repeat that for 23 minutes until it stops snowing, um, or at least until midnight. And that's it. That's how you uh, kind of approach snowy. It, it sounds very intimidating. Uh, but once you get into it and start practicing it, you get right into a rhythm and it's not that big of a deal. And that's basically it. That's the whole like quote unquote loop. That's your rotation for uh, Snowy. Uh, it's a bit of a unique fish in the sense that it's what happens if ocean fish were on land. It's like a 23 minute long spectral current. Um, but that's about it. So. Uh, I, once I finally catch this guy, I will get a proper video guide out, but I hope that this was helpful in kind of getting you closer to your own catch, and I will uh, see you in the next one. So good luck and happy fishing.